as the administrator of HN, taking over Q's trip code would have been as easy as rifling through a filing cabinet. We know there was a writing style change, which might explain why Ron went out of his way to reaffirm that Q's style never changed. Well, I, I like how uh, Q is very consistent with what he does. And in order to throw off anyone who came sniffing around, wouldn't it be smart to create a fake digital forensics trail, one that leads to someone from Trump's inner circle? The IP pointed in a neighborhood of like five houses, and one of those houses is Steve Bannon's house. Maybe this is why Paul Ferber becomes convinced on January 5th of 2018 that Q was hijacked. Was he seeing this new forensics trail that pointed to Steve Bannon? I sent him a private message to Code Monkey and I said, dude, that is not Q and you know it. Of course, this theory lacked definitive proof. Someone saying, yeah, I did it. Which brings us back to what Ron told me. If you look at my Twitter feed, that's what I'm doing publicly now. It is what you're doing publicly now, yeah. I've spent the past, what, like almost 10 years every day doing this kind of research anonymously. Now I'm doing it publicly. That's the only difference. Hmm. Yeah, I've noticed you... you know, don't, don't think for a second that half the threads on full weren't like me digging. Ron had always been like adamant that he wasn't really a user of 8chan. I don't post much there myself. Uh, every once in a while, I'll post as admin. He always claimed he wasn't involved in the research or the digs. Even as a user, I don't partake much in their discussion. And I don't know the intricacies in exactly what they're doing. But then, in our final conversation, perhaps wanting the credit, he admitted something shocking. Ron hadn't just been participating in Q research. It sounded like... He was leading it. Yeah, so thinking back on it, like uh, it's basically, it was basically three years of intelligence training, teaching normies how to do intelligence work. It's basically what I was doing anonymously before, but never as Q. See that smile? Ron had slipped up. He knew it, and I knew it. And after three tireless years of cat and mouse, well... <laughs> <laughs> never, never as cute, I promise. <laughs> never as cute. Okay. Because I am not cute. <clears throat> <laughs> I never was. Oh, man.